we have seen a significant rise in flu and strep cases. At San Angelo's La Esperanza Clinic, nurses say they've been seeing more people with flu cases in recent weeks. According to the Centers for Disease Control, over the last few weeks, the state of Texas has seen high and widespread levels of influenza. Even though flu season has already started, it's not too late to get the flu vaccine. Vaccination should continue throughout the season so that as many people as possible can be protected from the flu. The flu season runs through April. However, cases of the flu can be seen year-round. The reason health officials are stressing the importance of getting a flu shot. We're looking for herd immunity uh, for patients that are over the age of 65, uh, pregnant women, um, you know, you're looking at cancer patients. We're trying to protect those individuals. Stovall says the last few weeks, cases of strep have also been on the rise in the Concho Valley, especially in children. Many kids between the ages of 5 and 15 are usually the ones that are the strep carriers. And right now we are seeing a large um, surge in strep throat cases. She recommends washing your hands often and well and covering your mouth and nose when coughing and sneezing. Stopping the spread of germs is key to staying clear from strep and the flu. If you have symptoms of either a cough, fever, or sore throat, go to your doctor and get tested. For News Connection, I'm Amanda Lozano.